I think it might be time to link up with some of my favorite video game zaddies. What's up everybody? I'm Kelsey and I thought it would be funny to try the 100 infant challenge speed run. It's like the 100 baby challenge with some loosey goosey adjustments to the rules. We are a fourth of the way through the challenge. I'm excited. You're excited. The house, it still is not a cute house, but someday I trust it will be cute. I'm still going to keep saving up money and then we'll do a massive, beautiful remodel. Or we might just move to a new location. Who knows? Maybe we need to expand and get a backyard. But let's hop into this because we got to seduce Link from Legend of Zelda. Okay. Very timely with Tears of the Kingdom just having been released not too long ago. We're beginning with Chelsea as she was surrounded by beautiful video game men. We've definitely met Leon. Oh no, we haven't introduced ourselves to any of these other Sims. Okay. Well, she's just in a full conversation with Leon and Link. We might as well introduce ourselves to, oh my gosh, but I want to make a baby with Gerald. And oh my God, Connor from Cyberlife is a dead ringer. You guys nailed him. So we've introduced ourselves. Link is getting our number. He's really chatting us up, which is great. And Slender Man is lurking in the background as only Slender Man can be. But you know what? He's hotter than some other characters. And Marcus from Detroit Become Human is also our friend somehow. Yeah, we've met Marcus somehow. We have amazing compatibility. How do we have such amazing compatibility with all of these game characters? Let's go home to our kids. It's about that time. Also, I think it might be about that time to have our baby. Let's go home. I don't want to have a baby surrounded by all of these meds, okay? But don't worry, you guys will be hearing from me very soon. We're gonna be having this baby shortly. That wasn't a dig on you, Link, okay? You're the same height as everybody else in this realm. Oh, we're home! We have so many kids. How you doing, Amelia? She needs to get a skill up to level three. Logic. Dancing is also high up there. Why don't you do some dancing, girl? Okay, let's listen to some of your favorite, some hip hop, because you're also tense, so this is kind of perfect timing. She goes. All right, why don't you dance, girl? Jonathan, you also need a level three skill skill and your highest is logic or charisma. Sienna needs attention, but otherwise is fine. Sasha is in the middle of the road and Lucas is downstairs. Great. As usual, my infants just get spawned into random places. So we're going to just teleport them kind of into nearby locations. Okay. Who needs to go to bed the most? Lucas. All right. So let's have Chelsea put us to bed. How are the rest of the kids doing? Mason's doing great. Mason hasn't done his homework yet. So why don't you do your homework? I know it's nearly midnight. Roy and Rebecca. Rebecca are sleeping together in the tent. It's so cute. And Chelsea's putting a sweet baby angel to bed. Amelia just finished level three of her dancing skill. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous girl. Crushing it. Okay, why don't you go use the toilet? Oh, she loves dancing. Yes, of course you do, Amelia. I said that from the start. All my kids doing homework at the table together. I <laughs> love it. Amelia having dinner with them. I need to get a bigger table. That's one thing we definitely Definitely need, I think. Sasha's being sensitive. Oh, and feeding Tinkler. Great. So nice. Yay! Yeah. How are you doing with milestones? You're not. So why don't you play with your toys? Let's put you down, sweetie, so you can go to bed. And Sasha, why don't you finish up so mom can change your diaper? We're taking care of the triplets so far, so good. Who am I holding? I'm holding Sasha. Sasha needs to go to sleep. Okay, so, so Sasha's gonna go to sleep. And Chelsea's gonna go get some food because she's hungry. Good job, Chelsea. And all the kids, I think you guys can all go to bed right now. Why don't you guys sleep here? Chelsea's going to bed. Good. Okay. Everybody seems to be off to bed. Oh, and we don't actually have any kids here. We need to delete these to get some more money. Fabulous. Okay. We're getting up there with money. So I feel like a makeover is imminent. Hopefully. Amelia and Jonathan are jokesters with each other. I love that. I like that they're buddies. That's so cute. Did he get his skill up? No, he still isn't a level three in logic. We need to get something logical. Maybe we need to get chess. I feel like chess is like a constant thing. I'm constantly like, Ugh, if only we had a chess board. Maybe we'll put the chess here here and then we'll just grab another yellow chair. I think he can play chess like that. I mean, he won't get to play against anyone, but he could play some chess. I need you guys to sleep. It's 4 a.m. So you guys should sleep at least a little bit before school, except for you, Jonathan. You have to stay up and play chess. He is liking it though. He's feeling confident and playful. You know what? I could have put the chess downstairs. What was I thinking? All right, well, he's done with his logic. So let's have you go off to bed and I'm actually gonna move the chess downstairs, maybe in lieu of this area. As much as I like the puzzles and I think that the kids like the 
the puzzles, it might be more useful to do chess versus puzzle. We can also swap it out whenever we want. There we go. Now we've got some space. Sasha just learned to grab. Are you Lucas? Lucas is hungry. Mother, wake up. You need to feed Lucas. Go bottle feed your baby. I cannot believe we have not had our children yet. We are on the third trimester of our pregnancy. Hello, how are you doing? You're good. You might want to be fed. And you are mad just because you're awake. You don't really need too much. Why don't you go back to sleep? And Chelsea, why don't you play with Sienna and do some tummy time? Great, we're doing some tummy time with Sienna. How are the Todds? Oh, they're outside. They're tired. They're hungry. They're chatting with their sister. I forgot they were out there all night. The twins. Okay, let's go grab some servings inside. Okay, kids. Look at sweet Mason watching television downstairs. Wow, that TV is definitely broken. Morgan's still sleeping. Oh, it's a Sunday. They don't even need to go to school. I was getting everybody ready for school and it's like a moot thing. It was not even gonna happen today. It is what it is. We can continue on our skills for our bebes. It's okay, Sienna. You got this. Looks like it's a rainy day. Oh my gosh, what is your problem, Amelia? Amelia just seemed to have like a bad reaction to Sienna. Are you kidding me? She's jealous of Sienna. She's like, ugh, so jealous of these new babies get way more attention from mom and mom just has me take care of them. Like, girl, did Sienna learn something new? She did. She learned her first gross motor skill. Good job, Sienna. Four for you, Sienna. You go, Sienna. Oh my gosh. And it looks like Roy is also jealous. Oh my gosh. Everybody's jealous of Sienna right now. And oh my gosh, Chelsea's in labor. Finally. Oh my gosh. She's bursting with anticipation. Girl, you don't need to be eating right now. We got to go. Girl, we got to go. Put it down. We got to go. We got to go to the hospital. Yeah. She's like, I need Pepto-Bismol. Girl, you don't need Pepto-Bismol. You need to have a baby at the hospital. Okay. We're going to join you. I think these are Jeb Harris's kids. So that's exciting. Let's check in or not. I don't know. Leon thinks Chelsea's future space as well. Wants to become best friends. Okay, Leon. Wow. Leon Kennedy, a good friend to have, I think, especially at the end of the world. He'd definitely protect her. He's like, wow, I just came to join you. Well, that's great, buddy. We're actually checking in to have a baby right now where we can chat, I guess. Our strong friendship got me thinking, how about we live together? Can I move in with you? Ah, uh, I don't think that's a good idea, Leon, but thank you so much for offering. I'm so sorry. I gotta go have a baby right now, but I love that you came to the hospital. What a supportive little bean he is. He's coming with us. Oh my God. Maybe we should have Leon's baby. He's right here. Is there a shower in here? We could lock this down. I thought that, you know, Link would be more of the one that's a hoverer, but Leon's like, uh-uh. He's cleaning up our dishes from when we left them like forever ago. I know there's a lot of Leon girlies and I wasn't necessarily one of them. He is growing on me. Oh my gosh, and it's a boy. We should name him Leon Jr., honestly. But no, it's not Leon's baby. Let's see what our options are. This one says having triplets named Huey, Dewey, and Louie would be kind of iconic. I think that's very funny. So let's try it. So this is Huey. Huey and Peter Schmay. All right, let's see. Okay, it's a girl. So uh, the girl could be Lou or Louie. I think Louie as a girl is cute. So Louie is the girl. T just twins? Oh, we didn't get triplets this time. Okay, so it's just Huey and Louie. This is the problem with me making Sims with like twin names is I can't control how many I have, nor am I controlling what their genders are. So it's kind of hard. What happened to that man? Let's do a little like flirtation while we're here. I mean, you're here. I'm here. You came all the way to the hospital. No, Wolfgang, I'm not answering the phone for you. Rosalie's calling. I'm sorry, Rosalie. Ah, the game was like, go home to your new children. I was right there with Leon. It's fine. We can invite him over. But I did say that we would go with Link first. So I think I'm going to stick with that. I'm going to invite over Link. You and Louie, where did they go? Where were they spawned? Okay, they're spawned in here. All right, Hugh and Louie, you guys can go my bedroom. Twins this time. Okay, so that brings our total up to 25. We just hit 25 kids. Counting our occult babies as two. So that means we need to get these kids starting to be aged out. Are you guys ready to be A students? You are, but you're C students. We got a bit for you too. So let's invite over our lovely, lovely Link. Can you hang out at my lot? Would you like to explore my water temple? He'll be right over. Yay, Link is here. Okay, Link, let's invite you in. Chelsea, do not, oh my God, is this child? My children are on the street again.
again. I left them in the house, safe in their cribs. What's going on here? At least it's only Lucas, but he's sad because he's in the ring. I'm like, Lucas, you were in the crib when I left you. How do you get out there? Why are you heartbroken, Link? Let's brighten your day, Link. What's going on? Compliment his outfit. Come on, Link. Let's link up. Oh, Sienna laughed for the first time. So cute. I mean, speaking of Sienna, why don't you put Sienna to bed? Chelsea, back to Link. He's happy now. We cheered him up. Honestly, uh, this is the most I've ever seen Link speak ever. Oh, first kiss is available. Here we go. Here we go. There we go. We got our first kiss down with Link. Okay, can we now woohoo yet or nah? Maybe not yet. Come on. You know you want to woohoo with me, Link. Yes, okay. It says try for baby. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Let's just do the bed. Although Link does seem a bit more adventurous. It would be kind of more normal to try for baby with Link in this house, in the enclosure, you know? Let's do this, you know? You can call me Zelda during the process if it, if it makes you feel better. They're going outside. Oh my God, they both fell in the same that would be the noise he'd make. That also might be the noise he makes in the bedroom. Who knows? <laughs> Meanwhile, while that's all going on, we have two teen Sims who are just ignoring these babies' needs. How are you doing, Rebecca? Oh, Rebecca's sad because she's like, there's new kids. I thought I was the baby. You're like, no, you're not even close to being the baby, Rebecca. You are a baby. You're not the baby. Okay, these two are taking care. Thank you, team. Look at these Santa children being such sweethearts. Chelsea and Link just finished up. Let's take a pregnancy test and see if we are pregnant. The babies are taken care of. Mason is uncomfy because he is wet. Okay, why don't you do take a little warm shower? Warm up, baby. It's okay. Oh my God, Chelsea's hysterical, but it's okay because I think she's pregnant. So I think she's going to be fine. So it's saying here that pregnant Sims can age up. So I'm assuming she is pregnant. However, the pregnancy test is not... Oh, it's saying throw up too. It's not showing that she was like officially announced to be pregnant, but it's fine. We'll calm her down and we'll go efficiently care for our babies. Chelsea, you're good, right? You're good. You're calming down, please, ma'am. Please calm down, Chelsea. Chelsea, are you calm down yet? No, she's still cracking herself up. This is stressing me out. Okay, the children need help. Roy is very sad. So why don't you sleep in your bed, okay? I don't know why you keep sleeping outside. That just seems like a thing that you shouldn't have to do. Chelsea, please, 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 please calm down. Please calm down, Chelsea. You're freaking me out a little bit. Chelsea, calm down. Oh my goodness, Ellie is here. Wait, oh, that's a kid. I was like, I thought a toddler was in there. Oh, he's crying to Ellie who came over. Over. Thank you, Ellie. Why don't you just chat with Ellie a little bit and then why don't you go to sleep, Rebecca? Chelsea, are you chill now yet or no? Chelsea's literally still doing this stuff. Okay, let's just go to sleep, Chelsea. All right, go to sleep. Okay, now she's very playful. Chelsea was scaring me there, but she's asleep and she's fine. Amelia's taking care of the babies. She's putting two babies on top of each other. Of course she is. Who's at the door? It's Adrienne Fang. Is that one of your guys' friends? Maybe invite Adrienne in. She's in the rain. It's, an, it's a child. Oh, oh, the kids are cheering on one of the infants that just had a milestone. Adrian's like, it's raining and I was outside. Can I come in? Yeah, of course you can. This house takes care of children. That's like their whole thing. So, you know, come on in here. We'll take care of you like your family. Okay, can you go to sleep, please, ma'am? Sir, go to night night. Jonathan's taking care of everybody. Everybody seems like fine. Lucas is going to bed. Chelsea, I think is fine. Oh my gosh, I love Ellie's just hanging. Yes, Ellie. I love when my kids just to hang out with me. I miss them so much. Mom's good. Why don't you come and feed Sienna this beat? Is she's gonna go check on her? She's feeling very playful. <laughs> love that. It says throw up, so I'm assuming it says new baby. It's not saying she's pregnant though, Ugh, which might take longer if it's like not official, but it is what it is. Oh, you're feeding Sasha, good big sister. We definitely need some more food. Maybe you could get some more food, please, for the babies. Oh my gosh, and we got infants crying, or newborns, I mean. Sasha, why don't you play with some toys? Kelsey, why don't you go take care of the baby? Oh, you can't? Okay, go get food then. Jonathan's on the case, what a king. Oh my gosh, he's amazing. Why don't you go take a nap? Not in the tree house, okay? You have a bed downstairs. Go take a sleep. Oh, Ellie's like, I gotta get going now. Ellie, I feel like you just got here. Oh. Huey is upset. Mom, oh my goodness. Mom has a lot of things to do. Why don't we efficiently care for Huey? Why did you bring this outside, girl? Chelsea, what are you doing? She came to sit down and say that she needs to pee, which you don't. And now you're gonna go upstairs? 
just, that was weird. Ellie's still here. She was like, I'm gonna go and then stayed. Rebecca, oh no, Rebecca. Why don't you eat some food while you're upset? Roy is sad just because there's other kids around. Roy's in his sad boy era. These two are just little chickens downstairs having a good time, making new friends with Adrienne. Let's figure out what's wrong with Louie because Huey seems fine. Rebecca's chilling. Roy needs some movement. Okay, why don't you get some stack help from Ellie? Amelia's a little stressed. Okay, why don't we quickly change that diaper here of whoever you're holding. It's Sasha. And now Sasha needs to go be put to bed. Thank you, Amelia. Then what does Rebecca need? Rebecca needs some hygiene. Mother, dearest, give me bath time. Does che is Chelsea sewing that she's pregnant? I'm gonna like really quick on MC Command Center just check on her pregnancy. She is in trimester one. What are you doing? She's getting some hunk food. She's very, very hungry. How are you doing, Sienna? Sienna's going to bed. Fabulous. Lucas is sleeping and Sasha is trying to sleep as well. Rebecca is good, is with mom getting a bath. Perfect. Roy is actually pretty happy having some attention from Ellie who's helping him stack. And Morgan is playing in the garbage. Morgan, can you stop doing that? No, no, thank you. Not cool, man. Not cool. It is 11. So it's kind of time for all the kids to go to bed. Let's go to bed. Jonathan's asleep. You could be asleep too once you're done dancing. Chelsea's putting a baby to bed. How you doing, Amelia? You're in a better mood. Perfect. Okay, why don't you go downstairs and go to sleep? Who else is up? Roy is up and sad. Why are you sad, Roy? No attention left. You're getting attention right now and Ellie looks just like your mom, okay? It should be fine. Ooh, we're movement level three. Perfect. So we need potty and probably like maybe communication or thinking. What are the other ones? But we're, we're doing okay. Okay, Chelsea, go back to sleep. Don't take care of that. I'll take care of it. Had a long day. Okay, everybody's asleep. I might like do kind of zones with some kids here. Let's see. We're gonna hang out with Sienna for a bit since everyone else is asleep. Sienna learned how to babble. Great job, Sienna. Ellie's like, I should be going now. You've waylaid me long enough. I'm like, fair enough, okay? It's fine. And Lucas is up and Lucas is kind of hungry. He needs to go, okay? And Chelsea's up because there's babies. Go check on Lucas because the babies are all fine. The infants are great. Or, oh my God. Gosh, the newborns. Let's quickly do some tummy time with Lucas because I don't think Lucas really has any skills yet. Any big milestones? No, Lucas has zero milestones. He has none. So he needs to be taken care of by Chelsea. Chelsea, why would you do tummy time on the porch when it's raining? You could be literally putting him here. Like put Lucas down over there. What are you doing, you weird flirty girl? New skill day was awful for everyone except for the younger kids. <laughs> but Lucas, look at you. He learned how to reach. Good job, Lucas. Not from mom's help, that's for sure. Okay, Chelsea, since you're like being buggy, why don't you come and give a bath to Sienna, who is absolutely staying? And Lucas, you can just, uh, oh, he's using his diaper. He's using his diaper. Oh, and he also has a blowout. Awesome. I love that. But I like that we have this like quiet time with the infants. Ooh, yeah, she's upset. I know you're tired, sweetie. We'll get there. We just need to feed you really quick. There we go. We're gonna feed her. Oh my gosh, all the babies are crying. Help. Now we're going to quit quickly, efficiently care for this baby. Sienna is gonna to go to sleep. Who else is up? Sasha's up. Sasha would like some food, ma'am. Chelsea, it's all you. Go get Sasha quickly. Sasha's getting some food. Good, good, good. Fantastic. Oh, and Mason's got a loose tooth. Congratulations, Mason. All the boys are waking up. Ooh, it looks like some of her kids are having questions for her. Oh, a text emergency from Jonathan. I texted someone, but they didn't text me back, and it's been like an hour. Should I text them again? I don't have anyone with high emotional control. So I'm gonna say, yeah, maybe they missed the first one. Let's see if how his emotional control is. Okay, his emotional control is actually pretty good and so are his manners. How do we level this up? Winding down interactions on radios or instrument and drawn to clear mind. Okay, let's like wind down because he does seem uncomfortable. So let's wind down with some classical. Let's do our best. Maybe Jonathan will be my favorite. He'll have the best emotional control of everybody. Let's put Sasha down and let's go to sleep really fast while we have time. Everybody is waking up right now and it is so much. It is so much. They're all waiting for mom's attention so they can ask her questions and she's just never available so that they all get mad. Oh my gosh, all my teens are leaving me. They're all gonna leave me. No, I'm nervous. Good luck at school today. Have fun. I'm gonna be alone with seven children under the age of four. Amazing. I'm so excited. Oh my God, Link's here. He wants to be best friends. Of course, Link. Oh, Link wants us to be his girlfriend. I'm sorry, Link. I've already said no to everyone else. I can't say yes to you. He's very sad. Oh, why don't you admire 
admire the courage. Oh my God, how cute is that? Roy can admire his courage, but also accuse it of moving too fast. That is so funny. A toddler has that interaction. Oh, is Lucas learning something? He's reaching a milestone. I don't know what it is. His laugh. He only has one fire motor skill. Are you playing? He's playing. Where are you going, little Miss Rebecca? You don't need to be in there. Hold on. What skill do you need? Imagination. Let's work on your imagination. Mom, I think I need you to come and go super efficient infant care for Lucas because his needs are rough. Oh my God, it's Huey and Louie's birthday. We got to get these triplets aged up. Otherwise, we're going to have five infants. Clean up Lucas and also change Lucas's diaper. There we go. He's feeling less stinky now. One more time and then we'll put him down or just ignore whatever I say. It would be really nice, Link, if you would help anything. You can tell I'm struggling. Oh my God, this baby noise of them crying is getting on my nerves. Oh my goodness, Roy, why are you so filthy? Why don't you play with the toy while Chelsea gets her act together? What does this baby need? Chelsea, one at a time. Okay, the baby's fine. All right, go sleep, Chelsea. You really need sleep right now. Oh my God, I'm stressing, I'm stressing. Lucas is fine, ignore Lucas. Sienna is a little hungry and so is Sasha. Ugh, they got dirty diapers, no! We're gonna quickly try to efficiently care for our infants here. We're gonna get it done, it's gonna be fine. Sasha's now perfect. Oh, Morgan wants to fight over classmate Adrienne. I think that's who came over the other day. And Jonathan's grades are up and so are Amelia's and Mason and Morgan also have their grades up, but they're B students so they can't be aged up quite yet. But that's amazing, kids. Oh, thank goodness we have our teens that have aged up. Although Jonathan is a bit of a far cry from having his emotional control character value all the way up there. But at least now I know how to do it. Maybe I can pick another sim. Oh, he's mortified. No, don't age you up. <laughs> if we age you up, you might die. We'll start with Amelia. Why don't you wind down with some classical as you like to do? Yes, kids. Let's go. Let's go, kids. Our mortified king, Jonathan. I don't know why you're mortified, but Amelia aged up and she is hot-headed, jealous, and lazy. She wants to be a party animal. She's a lazy, jealous, hot-headed party animal. Love that for you, queen. Are you winding down with the classical music, my king? Okay, why don't you keep going? Let's go, I know you're mortified. Let's keep winding down. Let's give yourself a little pep talk. You've got this, Amelia at least is ready to go. It looks like his mortification's going down quite quickly, so that's good. Louie is needing something from mom, but mom's already on top of it. Good job, mom, but once I think you're done baby feeding, you need to go to bed because, oh my gosh, do you need some help? Amelia, can you quickly give Roy a bath. Jonathan, he's gonna go for a little jog to clear his mind. Him going on this jog is helping with his mortification and I think it is also helping his emotional control. Oh my gosh, all my kids are not doing a good job. Can you please throw these things away? Why don't you wind down with classical music, you know, kids? We don't have to have you do it late. We can have you do it early. Yes, I'm adding emotional control to the young kids too. Why are you not in bed, Chelsea? Go to bed. I've been having you try to go to bed for a while. Your needs are so bad. How are you doing, Jonathan? Jonathan's doing great. How is his emotional control? It's going up. What is happening? I didn't click on anything. Oh. No, thank you. We did wash Roy, who's taking himself to bed. Rebecca, I think maybe you could go to bed too. Jonathan's like fun is going up. I hope his emotional control is going up. It's going up, but it will definitely not be at the right level, but that's okay. Amelia's feeling better, I think. Watch the current movie with your brother. That'll be nice. Look at that, some family bonding time. Why don't you just go home, Jonathan? Go home. And Huey is up, therefore mom is up. I like that I have this almost backwards where when the kids are at school, mom is awake and working. And then when the kids are home, she's asleep. Honestly makes sense. Link wants us to be his girlfriend again. Link, I'm sorry, no. I think you should go. I don't want you to die, Link, okay? I like Link from Legend of Zelda. I wanna have a good opinion of you. You seem a little clingy. That does kind of track. Most of the time, Link is looking for Zelda. It's like his whole like go-to kind of situation. So I kind of get it. Jonathan, are you feeling better now? We could try to keep working on his emotional control. What other things can help with emotional control? How do I speed run this? I think we just have to keep having him wind down. His emotional control's going up. He seems to be having a good time with his wind down. He's feeling confident. I wonder if journaling would help. The family journal, you know, they can all have one. There we go. That's some an emotional control situation. Good job. Wow, my kids are awesome. You just changed that diaper without me asking. Oh my goodness, this baby needs some situation here. Let's go give a bath. Are you giving a bath to Sienna? No, she's not giving a bath to Sienna. She is feeding Sienna. Which Sienna does 
does need, but you also need to give Sienna back. How are you doing? How's your emotional control going? Okay, it's going up. I honestly feel like we can make this happen with him. He is kind of hungry, so let's grab a serving. You, my little sir, can mop that up for me, maybe, please? Thank you. Oh, Lucas is hungry. No, poor Lucas. Okay, Chelsea, who are you holding? Sienna, okay. How's Sienna doing? Sienna's good. Sienna just needs to sleep. So let's have Chelsea really quickly put Sienna to sleep. And then now you can bottle feed your son. Oh my gosh, all the kids just need aged up and I'm stressing. Sasha, how are you doing? Sasha's doing great. Okay, you need some gross motor skills. Can we have you quickly play tummy time with Sasha, please? Please, 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 please. please. Jonathan's still hustling on his emotional control. I mean, it's going up. It's just not going up super fast, which makes me wonder how long I can do this for. What is happening? Oh my God, it's Johnny Zest. I was like, what is happening to my children? It is the ghost of Johnny Zest haunting me as usual. You know what, Jonathan? I think it's gonna be just better. I don't want you to go to school tomorrow. I think we'll just let you clean up. Oh, Jonathan's a kleptomaniac. He's self-absorbed perfectionist and a kleptomaniac. Oh, and he's an animal enthusiast. Fantastic. Okay, let's add some birthday candles to the cake so we don't keep eating it. I guess now you can just do whatever your heart desires. Roy really needs to go. Oh, Roy, don't go in your pants. Fine, Roy, just go to sleep. I was gonna potty train you. I'm running out of time to like train up these kids to age them up. I feel like most of the time I'm just like trying to keep up with their needs. We don't even have time. He only has one level three skill and Rebecca doesn't even have that. Oh wow, the ghost is playing basketball. Okay, Johnny, how is Sasha doing? Sasha's trying. Oh my God, and Huey is upset. I feel like these kids never Stop crying. I've been trying to do homework for school, but the last few assignments felt really hard. Spend more time. Practice makes perfect. Jonathan advised Morgan. Morgan needed some advice. Oh my goodness. They're upstairs in this house too. Okay. Why don't you go downstairs to sleep? Okay. And Jonathan, oh my gosh. Why are your needs so bad, dude? Sasha, you just need one more gross motor and then you could be a toddler. Doesn't that sound fun? Doesn't it? There she goes. Good job, Sasha! Oh my god, wait, what? I thought that was like her second gross motor skill. Are you kidding me right now? You can go to sleep in mom's bed, okay? It seems like you're real tired, so why don't you just go to sleep? Everybody go to sleep. Why are you picking up the toddler, Johnny? Put Rebecca down, okay? She's fine. She doesn't need you. She can grab some food. Actually, Rebecca, now that you're up, we can have some quality time here. We need you to work on your movement skill. Go work on your motor skill, Rebecca. School starts for Mason in an hour. Okay, all the kids get school in an hour. Mason's up and he is not looking that good here. Rebecca, good job. Why don't you go to sleep, sweetie? Morgan and Mason off to school. Someone at my door. Oh, it's our mailman. I forgot we haven't paid the bills yet. Chelsea's taking care of Lucas, who just had a milestone. Good job, Lucas. Principal's visit. Today, the principal is visiting Morgan's class. Everyone is to be on their best behavior and not interrupt the lesson. Unfortunately, the kids sitting behind us decided to pelt him with something. I think Morgan and Mason are both like a little bit of pranksters. I think he'd ignore it because I feel like he'd be like, ah, you can't get one over on me. That worked out for him. I'm glad that did. Oh God, Huey is a wiggly baby and Louie is a calm baby. At least one of them is calm. All right, we have two new infants. Chelsea, I think you need to help potty train some baby. I don't know what to, I don't know what to do. There's too much going on. Jonathan, I need you to help out with things, okay? I can't do this all alone. Jonathan, I need you. Oh God, this one needs food. Mother, please feed me. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Oh my God. Sasha needs help. Jonathan, come help Sasha. Go feed Sasha. Quick, 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 go help her. Oh, Sasha just unlocked some things. Good job, Sasha. Okay, is Sasha the one that could get aged up? Yes, okay. Let's just age up Sasha while we're already here. I know normally I try to wait until all of the kids are at the same age, but this is a speed run, baby, okay? No time to wait. Oh my God, and Mason and Morgan just aged up. Good job, kids. Sasha, happy birthday. You are now a full toddler. And she is a charmer. Oh, happy birthday, Morgan. Morgan aged up and is a kleptomaniac. I have so many kleptomaniac children. This is crazy. And Morgan wants to be a serial romantic. He wants to steal things and steal hearts. Good for you, Morgan. You live your dream. We got another age up here with Mason. Mason is self-absorbed. Okay, I'm having so many Sims have that. Ooh, he wants to be a super parent. 
transparent, but he is self-absorbed. So I think it's more like for himself than for anyone else. So we have a Sasha who's now a Todd, which is fantastic. We have Rebecca who is level two of movement. Okay, why don't we get some stack help from Jonathan to work on your movement skill? Oh my God, Lucas had his first word. I don't know if I've seen that. That's so cute. Good job, Lucas. We really, really, really need to age up these kids. Ah, so stressful. Rebecca, how are you doing, sweetie? Rebecca still needs to work on her movement skill. Rebecca, why don't you just go stack, okay? You don't need help. You can do it on your own. Oh, and Sienna learned to roll over on her back. Good job, Sienna. Oh my God, constantly people are doing things. I don't know what to do. Oh God, Huey needs something. Food? I don't know. Is Huey being fed by mom? Yes, Huey's being fed. Okay, good. Problem presented itself as it was being fixed, which is fantastic. I love that. Wait, Mason, why don't you change this diaper and then do some tummy time? I forgot I had like teens that can also help now. This is amazing. Oh my gosh, Lucas is hungry though. Ah, there's so many kids. Four infants, three toddlers, and a partridge and a pear tree. Oh, Amelia's family oriented. She just got that requirement because she's so focused on helping. That's so sweet. Who's outside? Oh, an inspector's outside. We don't have any need for you today, okay? Me and all of my billions of children are fine. We are fine. I am fine. This is fine. My older kids are sick and he's prating in it. What's going on? Let's quickly change this diaper. Oh my God. Here we go. Here we go. I think we need another crib. We'll put a crib in here. Go put Lucas to sleep because you need to go to sleep. Dude, what are you doing? Put Lucas to sleep in the crib. Like I said, go to bed. You're fine. Sasha, why are you up? Don't do this to me, Sasha. I love you. Okay, I'm sorry. Lucas, go to sleep. Oh my gosh, I have too many kids. I have too many kids. Amelia, go do tummy time with Louie. Thank you, Amelia. You are the best. How's Rebecca doing? Rebecca needs attention. Rebecca also would love to have some potty training. Jonathan, it's all you. Mason's just chilling. Mason, why don't you turn that off and go to bed, okay? Rebecca's getting potty trained. Amazing. Who is at my door at this time of night? It is a vampire, as expected. Not gonna answer that door, even if he is the cuter vampire. No, no, you don't. Don't you chat with him, Amelia. We're gonna play with Sienna, tummy time together, and get Sienna to be aged up. We need the Todds, obviously, to be aged up, which uh, they are not anywhere near because their potty is low. Like they can't even potty on their own. We got another Sasha's up again. Sasha, go back to sleep. Huey is up. Huey, do you need anything? Morgan, can you go feed Huey? Feels weird to say that. Oh my gosh, Chelsea's already in third trimester. It's like I blinked and it happened. Oh, Rebecca, Rebecca, go back. I was trying to do that hack where you like exit out and let the Rebecca stay on the potty. It didn't work. Both of them didn't do the thing. <gasps> Sienna, roll it over to her tummy. She's ready to go. Yes, finally, Sienna. Okay, we get to age up Sienna now too. Yes. Sienna, you are now a toddler. Thank goodness. So then we just need to get Lucas, who I think just needs two more gross motor skills. So we're almost there with Lucas. Amelia has, oh my gosh, so many traits. Look at her. She's stacked. I'm kind of shocked. Sienna aged up and she is angelic. That makes sense because she was so sunny as a baby. And Huey just uh, got a blowout. Wow, Huey. Great. Oh God, that's not good. That baby is not good. We got Louie figured out, I think, for the most part. Lucas is mad. Lucas needs some food. Oh my gosh, Chelsea's in labor again. Oh my gosh, Chelsea, go have the baby at the hospital. We're gonna join her. Chelsea, go, okay? Hopefully the infants will all be fine. All the blowouts will be taken care of. I'm manifesting it. It's gonna be fine. Jonathan, you were always my favorite. I didn't mean it when I said you weren't. <laughs> Amelia, you're also my favorite. You're my two favorites. All right, Chelsea's going in. She's gonna have the babies. I hope they're not triplets. I don't think I can handle triplets, but we're gonna have our first video game baby. <laughs> it's Link's baby. It's a boy! Izzy Thrills asked for Brody for a boy, so has been asking since the original. Okay, Brody it is. Brody and Peter Shmay, welcome to the family. And it's a girl. I saw one earlier that was really sweet. Oh, this is Luna. It's my daughter's name, and I swear watching you got me through my final stages of pregnancy. Welcome, Luna. Luna and Peter Shmay into the family. Brody and Luna, and only twins. Okay, thank goodness. Honestly, I was a little afraid. Oh my God, look how many kids I have now. I need to start moving people out. This is bad. Well, I think I'm going to leave this one right here with a total of, I believe, 27 kids at the end of this episode, half of which are still in my house, it feels like. We have to say goodbye to our lovely, lovely Avelia and Jonathan, some of the absolute favorites, and kind of move on with Morgan and Mason. We have a lot of kids to get through, and we have no children, only toddlers, infants, and newborns, so it's a lot. I'm very much afraid of next episode, but I am also looking forward to it. Keep leaving your baby names in the comments below, and until next time, 
time. I'll see you on the internet very soon. Bye!